This is ABC's World News Now. Hello to our fans online. I'm Rena Nina. And I'm Taman Bradley with the top stories on this Wednesday, July 2nd. Americans are still stunned after that nail biter that slammed the brakes on Team USA's World Cup hopes. After 90 minutes of scoreless play, it all came down to extra time, despite a spectacular performance by goalkeeper Tim Howard, who knocked a record setting 16 saves. The Americans fell shy in round 16 against Belgium. Along the East Coast, 4th of July plans may be in jeopardy. Tropical Storm Arthur is gaining strength off the Florida Atlantic coast. The storm could likely become a hurricane around North Carolina later in the week. Arthur is now packing 50 mile an hour winds and is slowly gaining strength as it moves north. Two tornadoes with winds up to 100 miles per hour ripped through a small town 80 miles southwest of Chicago. The twisters leveled dozens of homes and buildings across a path stretching a mile and a half. Miraculously, there were no serious injuries. That sexy felon declared by hordes of women as too sexy for jail could soon be trading his handsome mug shot for headshots. Jeremy Meeks has now landed an agent who's pursuing a lucrative modeling contract. Meeks will have to get past his legal problems first, though he's being held on a million dollars bail and a string of felony counts, including weapons charges. And to an even more adorable mug, a six-month-old bear cub in New Jersey got his head stuck in a plastic jar, and he was climbing up a tree. Firefighters arrived with a bucket truck. They tranquilized the little guy and then cut off that jar, which, appropriately enough, once held animal crackers. This little cub was de dehydrated, but he was okay. <laughs> Get more news anytime at abcnews.com. I'm Tamon Bradley. And I'm Rena Nine, and thanks for watching. This is ABC's World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it. More Americans choose ABC News to see the whole picture.